Welcome to Bakertown, guys, and happy holidays. To get in the spirit, we are playing a little bit of Cthulhu Saves Christmas. Now, we haven't played this game yet. Uh, it looks to be pretty good, and it's a Christmas game. So let's see what we got going on here. Yeah. I'm so, here with... Conan. My boy, O'Conan. Yeah. And we're going to trade off the controller. Oh, and... So let's see here. Oh, and here's... Oh, and by the way, um... I made some new users of for the Nintendo Switch. Also, my dad's mom is here. That's right. Yeah, my yeah, dad's mom visited us. is at our house right now, and um, yeah. So we've been having some fun. We saw Strange Worlds today. What did you think about the movie, kid? It was okay. Yeah, it was pretty good. Yeah, yeah, we saw a movie. So uh, let's hop into the game. All right. It was the insane. night before Christmas when all through Riley, not a creature was fighting, no one in the fray. No stockings were hung by the chimney with care, they all had been naughty, no St. Nicholas there. Cthulhu was nestled all snug in non Euclidean space with visions of destruction lighting up his cold face. When out of the altar there arose such a clatter that Cthulhu toppled out of bed to see what was the matter. There shall be no poetry in my game, narrator. I promise nothing. But what's this? A present? From Santa? This cannot be. Goodness knows I've been anything but good this year. And yet it was a present, and it did have a tag indicating that it was from Santa. Cthulhu opens the present. Yeah, what foul sorcery is this? A dark mist envelops Cthulhu, stripping his power away from him. Not my power. That's one of my favorite things. What about your family? <laughs> Without my power, how am I supposed to destroy the world? No, this shall not stand. I shall have my revenge. I will not rest until the blood of Santa adorns my blade. Excuse me, but I do not believe this is a... F I do believe this is a family, family friendly game. Do I look family friendly to you? Plus, the game is literally called Cthulhu Saves Christmas. And uh, save it I shall. Santa has lost his marbles. He must be stopped. To the surface world, my quest for vengeance begins. I'm guessing he's going to be like the Grinch. Okay, here's our menu screen. And we're save. Play and we're playing on Sang mode. Yeah, Sang so mode. Party chat. So let, so let me see. Let me see. It's a bit more green on the, t on the TV, but it's like... But it's like kind, but it's, yeah. Okay, yeah. Oh, wait a minute, let me, let, me, let, me, let, me, let me figure it out first. We're all, we're going to play together. Oh, I'm just walking around here. On the beachy shore, bordered by the cliffs of insanity, Cthulhu spots a maiden beset by horrible monsters. A tutorial battle approaches. Uh -huh. Basic tutorial one, recharge items hyper. All right. Most character abilities can be used once, and then they're disabled. Use a defend command like rest to restart, recharge your character abilities. Okay. Items are shared by the party. They are recharged at the start of the battle, but cannot be recharged mid-battle. Characters gain hyperpoint each turn. When a character reaches their max hyper amount, then they go into hyper mode. In hyper mode, abilities are enhanced. They may deal more damage, have more targets, uh, or other bonuses. Plan ahead and make sure you have a powerful ability ready to take advantage of hyper mode. Okay. So, skill. Lock. So, let's see. So, that's a defend. Air damage. Let's Lightning on that guy. Pick one. They both have the same name and the same power things. Yeah. So I think those are their weakness. Yeah, they're weak against whatever that is. So. Wait, hang on. Uh, let me check the icons. No. Wait. So wait. So 
There you go. There's that, that one. There you go. Got him. Got him. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, my gingerbread. You're Cthulhu, right? They just sent me. Just make sure I read it. Just look at me. These tentacles and wigs don't lie. I know granting boons is not your nature, but I'm sure you'll make an exception for me. I need your help. Hard pass. Don't get your tinsel in a twist. I just need a teensy tiny favor, and I'll be sure to make it worth your while. I doubt that, but continue. I am the Snow Maiden, Crystal Claws, defender of the Winter Highlands and spreader of holiday joy. All right. I need your help to rescue my grandfather, Santa Claus. Let's go, buddy. Press the button. You're kidding, right? Have you seen the title of this video game? She's not kidding. The League of Christmas Evil has kidnapped Santa Claus. So pay the ransom fee and be done. They don't want money. They want Santa out of the way so they can take over their holiday for themselves. They have been sending anti-presents, packages that when opened give the recipient the opposite of what they most desire. That must be why I felt my power draining. If they were powerful enough to kidnap Santa, they must be packing some serious firepower. And since your name is literally in the title, and you... You have to be so super strong, right? True, I am indeed mighty, even when operating at less than optimal levels. If you help me rescue Santa, I guarantee you that you'll be prominently on Santa's good list. No more coal. Actual presence. Hey, Dad? Yeah? Oh, hang on. Um, we should someday do a Roblox video. Okay, we can try. And if I were to wish for the power to destroy the world, I'll make sure it's granted. Oh, Crystal, come on. Don't do that. Really? Santa's going to give me the power to destroy the world? That feels off-brand. He might have reservations, but I'm sure when I explain to him what happens at the beginning of Cthulhu Saves the World, he'll be fine with it. You have a deal. I, I shall save Christmas, only to destroy it. <laughs> Cthulhu and Crystal Claws have joined forces. Okay, so now she's on your team. Basic tutorial 2, running menu, save encounters. Hold the cancel button to run faster. So is that B? Yeah, or you can go to the other settings menu and set running as the default. Press the main menu button and you can adjust your equipped abilities, change your equipment and more. Don't forget to save often. Save menu can be found in the subsystem menu in the main menu. While traveling in dangerous areas, the encounter meter will fill up. When full, you'll be attacked. If you press the confirm button quickly, when a battle is about to start, you can avoid the battle. After defeating a certain number of enemies in a single region, the encounter, metal, me, encounter meter will stop filling up, allowing you to explore freely. You'll also get some bonus XP when you clear out all the enemies in an area. If you're feeling blood for, for blood lusty or just want more XP, you can start a battle manually from the main menu. Do the bare minimum, destroy everything in your sight or anything in between. The choice is yours. Alright. So save. There you go. Wait, wait. There you go. Save. 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 Okay, save, I think. Said twice. Okay. Let's switch. The basic one, simple robe, plain cloak. Now let's go. Uh, rusty sword, raggy tunic, blade tentacle. Bland tentacle. Bland tentacle. So equip items. More settings. Okay. I don't think we have anything yet to. Audio settings. Let's let's mess with the audio. No, no, mess with the audio. Let's go. Party chat tutorials. Quick. Okay. So if you hold B, it says run.
insanity abilities and unite moves. Wait. Each character can equip four regular abilities and one recharge ability. And the remaining three slots of are your sanity abil insanity abilities. Insanity abilities aren't chosen. They just pop up randomly from abilities you don't have equipped. As you level up, you'll gain more abilities, including some that only have a chance to appear as insanity abilities. Don't like the current insanity ability set? Whenever you recharge your abilities, the game re-rolls for new insanity abilities. One more thing, now that you have two characters in your party, you can use Unite, use unite abilities. Each Unite ability can only be used once per battle and cannot be recharged. Unite abilities start out weak, but the longer the battle progresses, the more powerful they become. United abilities gain 10% charge each turn, maxing out at 100% charge on a character's 10th turn. Using a United ability while hyper gives it an extra 20% charge beyond the listed amount. It's like you used it two turns later. The extra charge cannot exceed the Unite's ability of 100 charge cap, but can be used for more powerful Unites earlier in the battle. That's all for now. We will return you to your scheduled battle already in progress. All right. They're weak against. I don't use it yet. Remember, it said it gets stronger as the battle goes on. Well, never mind. Good job, bud. We got him. Chest. Open. Open the chest. Thank you for cleaning my toilet. You got a pain pill. Pain pill. Oh, see if you can go that way. See that, 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 see that little trail? See if you can go that way. No? Okay. Just check it. <laughs> Left or right? We're going right. Oh, dead end, but there's a chest over there. Okay. Whoa. Check the robot. See what he's weak against. Reading what they do. There we go. Chest over here. Let's see what we got. You got a strong wand. This weapon for crystal isn't actually strong. Okay, so go press the menu and let's see if it's any stronger than the one we got. So go to crystal. And then basic wand. So click, click on basic wand. And we want to switch to swung. Yeah, strong wand. There we go. All right. Save. We don't have any other stuff for them yet. There we go. Nope. 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 Yep.
crit damage. With the gentle baby. Come here, go back up. Back up to the left. And now to the right. And down, 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 down. Treasure chest. How do I ran? How does this randomly happen? Well, it says once you defeat all the enemies in an area, they'll quit coming, but we haven't defeated them all yet. And it, remember, it shows you on the meter. If it gets, whenever it's green, you don't have to worry. Yellow means you got a battle coming up, and then red means the battle's about to happen. Shadow Sword, alright. So now we got a stronger weapon for Cthulhu. Save. Save. We got something new, save. You can over you can click that one. Just override it. I've never been in an RPG before. How does this work? For starters, you have HP. When it goes down, alright, skip this. Blah, 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 blah. Left or right? All right. Go all the way around. 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 Help! Nope, nope, you're gone. I'm, I'm, I'm going to find that treasure chest. Well, we just got it. Uh, I was trying to do the, the thing where you press A and quickly get out of the battle. No, that's okay. Remember, the more battles you fight, the more leveled up you can get. Oh, there, there. That's one we, there we go. Oh, you're about to battle again. <laughs> you're taking too long. Keep on. Go all the way around. See if, we, see if there's anything on that left side. Keep going, keep going. Yeah. Keep going, keep going. I press a... Keep going. Here. Did you see what's over there? There might not be nothing over there. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Got the battle. Quit skipping the battles. We want to level up because the, the bad guys are only going to get stronger. You got a fur robe for Crystal. Okay. So let's egg on her. Switcheroo. Fur robe. Uh -huh. uh, Arctic Beast. Rid of one. Wait, that's healing. Yeah. See, it says down up there at the bottom. What? It tells you down here at the bottom. <laughs> Wait, that heals curses, but there you go. Jack Frost. So you're the one who is up to no good. Release my grandfather. Snow good. Oh, up to snow good. That's good. Ah. Hey, hey, Jack Frost, don't kill any more people. Oh, oh, oh. 
The League of Christmas Evil has lived in the shadow of that old coot for far too long. Now it's our time to shine. Hey, Jack Frost, you better not keep killing people. That's right. If by shine you mean the Japanese word for to die, then you are correct. Because that's what happened in your horror movie. You mm -hmm. killed people. Uh... It's a JRPG, you have to admit. Some of the players are familiar with the melodramatic Japanese battle cries. I don't have to admit anything, that's the point. With the big man out of the picture, I'm in charge. You talk big, but this early in the game, there's no way that you have the stats to back that up. Basic tutorial for ailments. See, we're not even out of the tutorial yet. I'm a tutorial boss. This cannot be. Uh, where was I? Basic tutorial for ailments. There are seven ailments. Insanity, stun, disarm, poison, charm, and rage, and vulnerable. Wait, so insanity, stun, disarm, poison, charm, and rage. And rage and vulnerable. The first and most important is insanity. Make an, an enemy insane and they'll take more damage from dark attacks, all dealing slightly more damage. And deal slightly more damage. Insanity always succeeds, but other ailments aren't guaranteed. You may need multiple attempts to wear down an enemy's ailment HP. Stun skips a turn. Disarm lowers attack. Poison takes damage each turn. These ailments are easier to inflict when the enemy is sane. Charm attacks allies. Vulnerable lowers defense. Enrage lowers AOE damage and is easily taunted. The ailments are easier to inflict against insane. These ailments are easier to inflict against insane enemies. Hey, Dad, can you can you hold this time? I want to go. I'm gonna go go get a drink. Okay. One last thing. Each time you inflict an ailment on an enemy, the enemy gains ailment HP. For that ailment, making it harder to inflict again. Are, are you done? So boring. Uh, I was just doing my job. Don't be sad, narrator. I'm sure with the power of the tutorial ailments, we'll sh we're sure to win this battle. Ho oh, ho! Enough tutorializing. Let's fight. Whoa. <laughs> So guys, um, my drink is a uh, purple hug, is a purple fruit little, uh, a little hug fruit barrel, and it's purple. Do not laugh at me in the comments, okay? <laughs> He's weak against fire, explosion, poison. Fire wasn't in the tutorial. Oh, never mind that. That was that was ailments, but the, but that thing is how what they're is is, is telling you their weaknesses. Can you put a straw on it? I'm sorry. We're gonna lay the smack down on the beach, Golem! Now we're gonna poison. Say it again. Touchdown! And we're gonna heal the party. Touchdown! And we're gonna use our tentacles. 
Tundam. And we're gonna. We're gonna. Lightning. Lightning. Well, let's let's stun it. How about that? Touchdown. And then now we're gonna. Don't waste the Necronomicon. That could, that could be powerful. Don't waste it. Uh, party dependent. Lightning bridge. Touch Got down. It. Bada boom, bada bing, baby. Touch Victory. Down. All enemies defeated. You gain two hundred twelve XP. Touch down. Touch down. And we got a fireball. We got a freeze. I said touch down one million times. And a cleanse. And you didn't say touch I can't believe down. I lost to a tentacle man and Santa's little brat. We slayed you, and don't you forget it. Enough idle chat. Tell us about the League of Christmas Evil. Oh, you are too weak to deal with the other seven. I mean, six members of the League of Christmas Evil. Wait, that's weird. What? That's weird. Whenever Jack Frost does his thing, and his face doesn't show up. Huh. Interesting. Maybe because he's not on our team. Maybe only our team members show up. Tell us which league member has Santa Claus. Maybe only the good team. Never. You're just going to have to interrogate them all yourself. There's no chance that the next league villain ha he we fight has the claws, is there? The players who spent good money on this game would be rather disappointed if that was the case. They probably got this game in one of those 10 million games for a penny bundles. Let them be disappointed. Since I've been defeated, I might as well as give you a tip. You'll never rescue Santa unless you master the power of relationships. Don't you mean relationships? It's my game. I'm from Relier. Relier. The terrible pun says. Spend time with different people in town to improve your relationships and get cool stuff. I like cool stuff. Defeat the other Christmas League of Evil members forge lasting relationships with others, and you just may rescue Santa. Whatever. You can't tell me what to do. If I rescue Santa, it'll be on my own terms. What's this feeling? Oh, I see. I'm being summoned away into a different RPG franchise. Hee-hoo! Now that's over with, let's head to Christmas Land. Welcome to Christmas Land, the Christmasiest place on Earth. And we will explore Christmas Land next time here in Bakertown uh, when we continue to see if Cthulhu can save Christmas. Thanks for stopping by. I think we're done with the tutorial, and we'll check you out next time. Bye. Bye-bye.